This NVIDIA 2080 Ti graphics card was overheating when it reached 80 degrees, running at 1080 HD resolution. And made the PC fans incredibly loud. Our customer called us to see if we could have a look at their gaming PC and see if we could test the PC in our workshop and fix the issues. Our techie got to work fast. The PC arrived clean, just like new, and worked really well. Inside the graphics card, it was a different story. After removing all the screws, we gave it a good blast with the air compressor. We air compressed on the board itself, in the graphics card's fan, and even the housing of the graphics card. You can see how much it really needed cleaning. However, that wasn't the end of the cleaning process. There was plenty of dust and dirt still left on the graphics card, so we cleaned the rest thoroughly with our special electronic board component brush. You can see how much dust there was inside the fans, so no wonder the GPU was complaining about the temperature and kicking on the fans. The old thermal paste was cleaned up effectively using alcohol wipes, ensuring that there was no trace left so the old thermal paste would not be mixed in with the new. Now, the NVIDIA RTX 2080 Ti graphics card was ready for us to reapply the new thermal paste. Not too much and not too little. Once we were happy with that, we started reassembling the NVIDIA RTX 20 Ti back together so we can test it back inside the PC. You will see that even though the graphics card GPU temperature reached 79 degrees, it never went above that temperature and for the most it hovered around the 76-77 degrees mark. We ran the final test that you can see at true 4K 4096 by 2160 at 120 frames per second and now the NVIDIA 28 Ti is as good as new. We hope you found this video from Tech Cut useful. If you did, please hit that like button.